Mrs. Johnson was a widow with two young children, Jack and Kate. Her husband had passed away a few years ago, leaving her to raise their children on her own. It was difficult, but Mrs. Johnson loved her children more than anything in the world and was willing to do whatever it took to provide for them. Mrs. Johnson worked hard every day to make ends meet. She had a job in a factory, but it didn't pay very well. She often worked long hours, sometimes even bringing work home with her in the evenings. Despite the long hours, she always made sure that her children were well taken care of. Jack and Kate knew that their mom worked hard for them, and they appreciated everything she did. They tried to help out as much as they could, doing chores around the house and helping with their younger siblings. One day, Jack came home from school with a request. His school was organizing a field trip to the zoo, and he really wanted to go. However, the field trip cost money, and Mrs. Johnson wasn't sure if she could afford it. Jack was disappointed, but he understood that money was tight. He didn't want to burden his mom with more expenses, so he decided not to go on the field trip. But Mrs. Johnson could see how much Jack wanted to go, and she didn't want him to miss out on this opportunity. She made a decision to sacrifice something important to her so that Jack could go on the field trip. Mrs. Johnson had been saving up for a new pair of shoes. Her old ones were worn out, and she desperately needed a new pair for work. But she knew that the field trip was important to Jack. So she decided to use the money she had saved for her shoes to pay for the field trip. When Jack found out that his mom had sacrificed something important for him, he was touched. He couldn't believe that his mom loved him and his sister so much that she was willing to go without something she needed to make sure they were happy. The day of the field trip arrived. And Jack was so excited. He had a great time at the zoo, and he couldn't stop talking about it when he got home. Mrs. Johnson was happy to see the joy on her son's face, and she knew that her sacrifice had been worth it. This wasn't the only time Mrs. Johnson had to make sacrifices for her children. There were times when she had to skip meals so that her kids could eat, and times when she had to work overtime to make sure they had clothes to wear. But Mrs. Johnson never complained. She knew that it was her responsibility as a mother to take care of her children, and she was willing to do whatever it took to make sure they had a happy and healthy life. As the years went by, Mrs. Johnson continued to work hard to provide for her children. She made sure that they had everything they needed, from food and clothing to school supplies and extracurricular activities. Despite all the sacrifices she made, Mrs. Johnson never let her children feel like they were missing out on anything. She always found ways to make their lives fun and enjoyable, even when money was tight. For example, during the holidays, Mrs. Johnson would make homemade decorations with her children, and they would spend time together baking cookies and other treats. They would also have family game nights and movie nights at home, which were always a lot of fun. As Jack and Kate grew older, they began to understand and appreciate all the sacrifices their mother had made for them. They were proud of her and grateful for everything she had done to provide for them. 
When Jack graduated from high school, he gave a heartfelt speech thanking his mother for all her hard work and dedication. He told everyone at the graduation ceremony how much he loved his mom and how she had been his inspiration to work hard and achieve his goals. Kate also followed in her mother's footsteps, becoming a hardworking and dedicated person. She went on to attend college and then graduate school, eventually becoming a successful businesswoman. Throughout their lives, Jack and Kate always remembered the sacrifices their mother had made for them. They knew that without her hard work and dedication, they would not have been able to achieve their dreams. As the years went by, Mrs. Johnson continued to work hard and provide for her children. Even though her children had grown up and moved out of the house, she never stopped being a loving and supportive mother. In fact, Mrs. Johnson became a grandmother when Jack and his wife had their first child. She was thrilled to have a grandchild and loved spending time with him. She would often babysit while Jack and his wife were at work, and she would take her grandson to the park or to the library. Kate also had children, and Mrs. Johnson loved being a grandmother to all of her grandchildren. She would often have family gatherings at her house, where she would cook a big meal and everyone would spend time together. Mrs. Johnson was also active in her community. She was always willing to lend a hand to anyone in need, and she was beloved by everyone who knew her. As she grew older, Mrs. Johnson's health began to decline. She had a few health problems, but she never let them get her down. She continued to live life to the fullest, enjoying time with her family and friends. One day, Mrs. Johnson passed away peacefully in her sleep. Her children and grandchildren were devastated by her loss but they knew that she had lived a full and happy life. They were grateful for all the sacrifices she had made for them and all the love and support she had given them over the years. At Mrs. Johnson's funeral, Jack and Kate gave emotional speeches, thanking their mother for everything she had done for them. They talked about her hard work, her dedication, and her unwavering love for her family. They also talked about the sacrifices she had made for them, and how those sacrifices had made all the difference in their lives. As they said goodbye to their mother, Jack and Kate knew that they would always carry her memory in their hearts. They would never forget the sacrifices she had made for them, and they would always be grateful for the love and support she had given them throughout their lives. After Mrs. Johnson's passing, Jack and Kate made sure to keep her memory alive. They would often talk about her with their children and grandchildren, telling stories about her life and the sacrifices she had made for them. They also made sure to continue her legacy of kindness and generosity. Jack became involved in local charities, volunteering his time and resources to help those in need. Kate started a scholarship fund in her mother's name, helping young people in the community pursue their dreams of higher education. Through their actions, Jack and Kate showed that Mrs. Johnson's sacrifices had not been in vain. Her legacy of hard work, dedication, and selflessness lived on through her children and grandchildren, and through the countless people she had touched over the years. As time went on, Jack and Kate grew older and eventually passed away themselves. But the memory of their mother, and the sacrifices she had made for them, 
continued to live on through their own children and grandchildren. And so, the legacy of Mrs. Johnson, the loving and selfless widow who sacrificed everything for her children, continued to inspire and touch the lives of countless people for generations to come. Her story was passed down from one generation to the next, becoming an example of selflessness and dedication that inspired many. The scholarship fund that Kate had started in her mother's name continued to help young people in the community pursue their dreams of higher education. Many of the recipients of the scholarship were inspired by Mrs. Johnson's story and went on to make a difference in the world, just like she had. The food bank where Mrs. Johnson had volunteered became a community institution, providing food and support to those in need. Her example of kindness and generosity inspired many others to give back to their community and help those less fortunate. And in the hearts of her family, Mrs. Johnson's memory continued to shine brightly. Her children and grandchildren often spoke of her with fondness and gratitude, remembering the sacrifices she had made for them and the love and support she had given them throughout their lives. In the end, Mrs. Johnson's story became a testament to the power of love and sacrifice. It showed that even in the face of adversity, a mother's love can overcome any obstacle and that the sacrifices we make for our loved ones can have a lasting impact on the world around us. The End